rules by Andrew Buckle. In this tutorial, I'm just going to show you how you can copy some parts to Dreamweaver using SVG. Now, one way of doing it is just going to File and then Save As, and then you've obviously got this, these parts here, and you can then select SVG format down here, and well, it's compressed as well. Just select that, and if you save, just quickly say, and you've got the SVG code there, so you just click on that, and you can just see the code just pop up like that. You can just see it there. Now, and just select it and copy and paste. But there is also maybe a quicker way of doing it, and I'm just going to just deselect that. Now, the key thing here is not to use any text. It doesn't work if you select any text. So if you're just using just basic parts like this, and I'm just going to select that. Just select that and then just go to edit and copy. Simple as that. Now, what you need to do also is just quickly go down here to preferences and file handling. Just select that. And you'll notice there's an option here, include SVG code, and that has to be on, so. Right, now just go over to Dreamweaver, and I'm just gonna obviously just, I've got a file here open, that's a thing, and I can then just Paste in, just control V, and there you have it, got the quick code. Now, it's not particularly the best formatted code, and personally, I like to actually trim it down a little bit so I can get rid of the, get rid of that, and get rid of that, get rid of the space, and I don't know why it actually adds the space in as well. Certainly there's even other bits and pieces you can get rid of there as well. Get rid of the defs, and then just clean it up, but anyway. There is a quick way of bringing some SVG code into Dreamweaver using Illustrator. And now just quickly finish that off. Now you can't see it there. I'll just go quickly go to live mode and just go down and there's the actual design there. So Illustrator to Dreamweaver. Hope you found this of interest. Thank you much.